Well, after months of debate and planning, the Bemidji JC's Water Carnival is officially underway. This year's carnival is split between two locations. Now Josh Peterson joins us from the South Shore location where Merriam's Midway is located. Josh. Thanks, Dennis. For months, the Bemidji JCs have been planning and organizing this year's celebration. Originally, the whole entire water carnival was supposed to be downtown. But after much debate, the Bemidji JCs came up with a compromise, and the idea of a split location was born. The concept of a split location is new for the Bemidji JCs. One location hosts the entertainment, and the other hosts the rides and attractions. For Merriam's Midway, who is operating at the Lake Bemidji South Shore, the Sanford Center parking lot is ideal. And having the carnival over on this side of the lake, it ended up being our compromise with the city and with the businesses. And it actually works out pretty well for us because we don't have to worry about any height restrictions, we don't have power lines or anything like that. The location also provides ample space for more vendors and games and even larger than life rides. The owner of Miriam's Midway actually prefers this location because there's more room for him to get his trucks in and out and more room to set up his rides. For some who attend the water carnival, they like the space and the prime parking so that they're able to check out the massive carnival rides. I thought that when they moved it from downtown that it would just destroy it, and it hasn't. In fact, the parking here is so nice because you can just park and walk over where downtown it was getting to be a a real parking problem. Many make it a point every year to visit the water carnival to see what's new and to go on their favorite ride. I love water carnivals, they're fun, I like the rides even though I'm too old to go on them, but I still do. With prime real estate, Merriam's Midway has shook up this year's water carnival, bringing to Bemidji a large glass house and a 100 foot drop tower called the Super Shot. For some, the Super Shot is a way to conquer a fear of heights. I'm so scared of heights, so that was not the best experience for me. It was terrifying. I was just hoping it would stop, then it keep going higher. And when it finally dropped, I was like, I just want to get off. So for those seeking thrills, or those who like to play it safe, this year's carnival has something for everyone. Now for those of you who can't get enough of the rides, there are unlimited ride wristbands available each day throughout the water carnival. Merriam's Midway here at the Sanford Center is open every day from noon until midnight throughout the water carnival. Dennis, back to you. Thanks, Josh. The Bemidji JC's Water Carnival runs each day through the 4th of July. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.